Hi, my name is Ramon Peguero. I'm Evelyn Cruz. Francis Lucerna. My name is Angel Pagan. Juan Ramos. I'm here to speak about... ...to talk to you about... ...my friend, my friend, my brother. My name is David Lopez. David is committed because he's lived it. He's been here. He's been impacted by the unfair, you know, the unfairness, uh, by the injustice that our community has lived through. David, in all the years that I've known him, whenever there was a community struggle or there was a community issue, he was the first to be there and present and saying presente. Um, he has an energy and a commitment to social justice and equity uh, that is outstanding and inspiring. David's commitment to um, his community and political action goes back decades. And if you ask, stop anyone in Williamsburg who knows David, they know of a struggle that David's been a part of. A person that feels for the people, wants for the people, and fights for the people. He has been a champion of this community for over three decades. David is uh, the soul of this community. And I say that because in every corner of this community, he has, he has touched it. Well, I met David back in the 1980s, early 80s. I was a teen at the time. And David Lopez, along with a group of, of Puerto Rican activists here in the Southside community of Williamsburg, uh, were organizing young people uh, to get engaged in the fight for housing. Not only preserving housing, but also fighting for affordable housing to continue to come into our community. I've been on many lines and marches with him, on many campaigns with him, and I've always been impressed, not only by his commitment, but by his energy. He also played a critical role, and really a leadership role, in saving Brooklyn Legal Services Corporation A at a time when uh, the larger legal services world was ready to close us down, a struggle we won in significant part because of the role he played in mobilizing community support for our, us and our work. He's always uh, fighting for, for people who don't know how to fight for themselves. I think that he's a person that believes that when you see a wrong, you have to step up to the plate and make it right. The strongest memory that I have of David is David the artist. David on stage at a point there reciting his poetry. He writes about the struggle, about the community. He writes about the struggles about young people. And I, and I think that's really special. In his poems, you could see what he's like. He talks about the things that he strongly believes in. A poet that's, you know, known, um, in particular around issues of social justice. Um, because he is so involved and committed to those issues. I think David's enthusiasm for life, it is uh, infectious, right? Uh, he takes time out for everybody. We walked down the street a little while ago. We say hello to everybody, like the old people, the young people, we know them more. He takes time out to talk to everyone. He walks the street with his Panama hat and everybody knows, Mira David, you know, they know him. I think that David's values and the goals and missions of Brooklyn Legal Services, A, are intertwined. He believes that we have to take care of those that can't take care of themselves. David has a lifelong commitment to justice and to equity and to his community. Um, I think that that is exactly in line and totally embodies the vision uh, and the mission of Brooklyn A. It's a mission that will stand for the underserved. Brooklyn A provides that ability, you know, for people to be heard and treated with dignity. I am proud to work with you as the chairman of the Board of Los Sures, and your inspiration and your guidance have, have really made a difference in the way that I am able to direct the organization. Gracias, hermano, por ser un luchador incansable, siempre creyendo en la comunidad y en la lucha. Palante siempre. Palante, David. Thank you for all your hard work and everything that you put into um, providing this community with an opportunity to be represented, to be heard, and to leave its footprint um, here. Thank you, David, for all of the laughter, uh, all of the joy, and uh, all of those moments of true and inspiring activism uh, and struggle that we have shared. Thank you, David. We're extremely proud and appreciative of both being able to honor you tonight and also being able to work with you on an ongoing basis.
Thanks, David, for all you've done with and for Brooklyn A over the years and the communities we work in together. Thanks, David.